Now it's just a matter of time that they're going to catch this guy. You know, there's no place to run, no place to hide. Well, Cleveland police in an all-out manhunt tonight searching for the person they believe may be responsible, responsible for the beating death of a popular east side businessman. 74-year-old Larry Mano was killed back in September. Five-year side investigator Joe Paganakis tells us police are crediting neighbors for leading them to a suspect. I'll tell you, when I think about Thanksgiving without Larry... In Christmas. Susan Sefchuk is still having a tough time holding back the tears. She worked 30 years with Larry Mano at his Buckeye Road landscaping business. Sefchuk left very emotional as Cleveland police now search for 24 year old Cedric Hawkins, the man police believe brutally beat Mano on September 16th. Mano dying several weeks later from his severe injuries. Sevchek hopes someone will give police the information they need to make an arrest. Hopefully, you know. The message will get out there because I know the neighbors around here are very upset about this. You cannot solve these kind of crimes without citizen participation. Buckeye neighborhood activist Rob Render says it was residents who provided tips that led police to Hawkins as a suspect in the case. And he believes it will be residents who will help police find their man within the next few days. They got a person and now it's just a matter of time that they're going to catch this guy. You know, there's no place to run, no place to hide for him. And Render says it's going to take even greater neighborhood participation to solve this case and many others in the Buckeye neighborhood since Cleveland police are still short on detectives in a fourth district that is the largest police district in the state of Ohio. I think they need to go back to the drawing board and take another look at that. The resources need to go where the greatest need is. And the greatest need, as far as we are concerned, is in the 4th District because of its size. And police say Hawkins is known to frequent the area of East 130th and Buckeye Road, just two blocks away from Mano's landscaping shop. Reporting on Cleveland's east side, this is 5 on your side investigator Joe Paganakis.